Good evening, Simon. West End drama, East End grit. The entire city of London separates these two clubs. Leighton Orient, the rising power in the East. Brentford, a club whose tale of late season misery could be told on a stage in the West End. Oh, it's a towering header from Harley Dean. They couldn't quite direct it. Oh, they'd be really disappointed. They're a very big side, Brentford. They've got Dean, there's Taylor Craig, there's Donaldson in there as well. And he gets a run on his, uh, his marker. It's a pretty much a free header, it's just slightly off balance and doesn't really attack it with the meat of his forehead, it just skims off his head. Lisby winning that flick. James, Lisby, on the Beja. Mooney is lacking! And this season, they have found the back of the net. And he knows he should have scored and this is what Orients are all about. They've been under pressure, but once they put three or four passes together, get Lisby and Odebaja involved in the game, then Mooney, he should really score here. He's under some pressure. Shalem Logan, the ball's just dropping over the head of Harley D. Maybe that's what puts Mooney on. Fiercely ambitious, fiercely driven. Well, the referee has given the penalty. He thought about it. It's really sloppy. It's poor from uh, from Brentford defensively. You can see clearly Shalem Logan is just wrestling David Mooney, and it's absolutely a penalty. It's David Mooney! He finds the spot! Placed to perfection! Leighton Orient, the most informed team in English football right now, hit the front in West London. Out of danger, this is Bat. Leighton Orient have come into Brentford's backyard and they are throwing their weight around. From Adebajo as he breaks forward, and we know Adebajo is a lively winger, but he just tucks in field here and the appreciation of where the movement is ahead of him is absolutely brilliant. As soon as he receives this ball, kills it stone dead.